Hi Diamond Friends, it's Linda from Diamonds for Linda. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. I really appreciate it. I know you all are busy, so it's much appreciated. Today I have an unboxing. It's a sneak peek from Bella Art Diamonds. So thank you, Jamie and Nicole, for sending this to me. I really appreciate it. Um, and we're also doing like a little giveaway. Well, you know, Bella Art Diamonds is doing the giveaway. So basically in this video, I will have like a special word that will um, write that down along with the canvas name so you know which one it goes to or my channel. And what will happen is Nicole will create a Google Doc once all our videos are out. So I will link to, I don't know if she's gonna do it on her live exactly, but I will, once, the, once she lets us know that the document has been created, I will either pin that in the comments, like where to go to find it or have it in the description. So um, yeah, so it'll be something fun. And, and the, the special word will be related to the diamond painting. And wait till you see this one. It is so adorable. Look at that, it's a little fox. And this one is called Rainy Dreams. It's licensed from Laura, let me look at that a little bit closer. LaGuire, I believe, or Lauren, Lauren, I'm sorry. I have um, over 40 eyes. <laughs> not over 40 eyes, but the age 40. <laughs> they say when you when you turn 40 plus that your eye, you're going to need like, if you already wore, wear glasses, like bifocals and all that fun stuff. But anyway, let's get back to the diamond painting unboxing. So I'll show it like this so you can see it a little bit better. So this is a 40 by 42 centimeters, 15.75 by 16.54 inches. I love the size of this one. I have a lot of diamond, large diamond paintings, so it's nice to have these smaller, legally licensed diamond paintings that are gonna, with the rendering, which this is hand rendered or charted. And here's the beautiful box that it comes in. And right here you have the instructions. And right here we have high quality canvas. Um, the thick protective cover, which I always appreciate that. We have premium poured glue, clear symbols, superior shine, hand rendered, licensed artwork, and these drills are resin, both in round and square. And every um, Bella Art Diamonds comes with this really nice tray. This is the, uh, their essential tray. Normally this is what you get in diamond paintings, a tray like this, but this one's a really nice and the, the walls are a little bit higher. And so I, I love that because I am when I use these and I shake, um, yeah, I'm not very, they kind of go all over the place. And there's like this little ramp right here. So when you're shaking, your drills aren't gonna just come flying out. I always shake like this where I kind of put my finger right there and shake it like that. And But um, you don't have to do that with this one. So let's go ahead and get this diamond painting out. And I'm going to put the box over here and there is this number and I believe that matches the canvas. Although if you separate your diamonds from your painting from your canvas, I would get a Sharpie or something and write the name on here. Okay, let's get this out. It comes with your protective cover, which is also great in case something happens to the box. Um, let's see. And I am going to fold this backwards. This is a really nice canvas. It will lie flat, but just to help it out for, you know, to make it a little quicker, we're going to go like this. And this is not, let me see, focus. Right here, this is not a river. Let me see if it'll focus. This is another um, essential tray that I ordered from Bell Art Nicole. So once you pull the plastic back and all, whoops. Got my little lint there. Um, that will disappear. Okay, so but I'm gonna go ahead and roll this back. Let's take the sticker sheet out. And we will go over with a cute little bag of diamonds. We're gonna go over the tool kit in just a second. So we do have the image right here, Rainy Dreams. And all the info right there, where it's licensed and the size. You have Bella Art de Nicole, where you can get the some accessories. It says fine diamond painting accessories here. They have cover minders. They have the trays. They have um, resin trinket trays. They have a lot of things. So go check them out. And here is all their social media. 
and you'll notice that this is scalloped and poked so it'll help through that grain and again this is the nice thick I don't know if you could hear that thick plastic so I love that so let's go ahead and unroll look how cute this is I don't know why my my phone is having issues with focusing today there you go so you have the legend on each side and I love that when you flip it over you'll also have the all the symbols um is right side up the correct word um, words so this is the canvas and then the top has Belle Art Day Nicole enhancing your diamond painting experience what's nice is Nicole diamond paints so she knows what we're all looking for in a canvas and here's Bell Art Diamonds hashtag for social media and Bell Art and Nicole Diamonds.com and where you could find the diamond paintings. So this one looks like it has 46 colors. And that'll fit in my little this. So this is from Bell Art and Nicole. This is where the baggies go in, which I'll show share with you. Let's go ahead and go with the toolkit. You get everything you need to start diamond painting. I could get it open. And this little baggie is nice because it's you can use it for other things. And this one is a round diamond painting. So you have your little pen here, and I think that's a three-placer. You have some tweezers, which you want to make sure that you put this on to keep from getting stabbed. Like I almost just stabbed myself. <laughs> that's what I get for looking. Like sometimes I, you know, with my eyesight and my glasses, when I'm too close, I can't see. So I'm going wear my glasses. And then you get some wax here. I love these little um, containers because you, you can use them for other things. But you get your three pads of wax. And you do want to peel the plastic back. Let me see if I can grab one before you load your pen up. And you can use these for like, um, like a trash tray after you're done with it or all kinds of little ideas okay so let's see what else we have we have some random washi tape so yours might come with another one but this is pretty it has some feathers on there oops and then we have some um gosh i can't think today <laughs> some multi-placers and a little squishy or comfort grip for your pen. You just put that on, which I usually have a hard time getting that on, but you could take this off and change out your multi-placers and you could probably maybe get this on that way. So let's put that back on before I lose it. So that is your toolkit, everything you need. And then there's no baggies in the toolkit because everything is just bagged and kitted up for you. So let's go ahead and take a look at these drills. We're going to, these are resin drills. I'm just going to pull out, here's the palette. Isn't that pretty? All those blues and greens. And then we have like a, like a reddish brown or something right there. So this one, oh, I guess I could share the uh, sticker sheet. Okay, so here's the sticker sheet. And I love that this is a sticker. You can either just cut this section out or put the whole thing in your logbook. Over here, you have the individual stickers to put on your containers if you do decide to kit up. You can also put these on your baggies. Um, you could put them, I would probably place them up here so when they're in their little bag stand, or you know, they could, you could see the symbol and find them pretty easy. So we have, let's see how many ABs we have. So we have 46 colors and two ABs. And the ABs are going to be a brown and like a gray, a light gray. And I love that the symbols here, if you notice that, let me go like this. So we have um, the numbers one and it matches with one. So these aren't off. Like sometimes you'll see a four, but this will be a five. So this is really great. It goes all the way up to eight. And then you have some letters and then you go down into the symbols and what i appreciate is bella our diamonds doesn't put all these different arrows going every which way so that's really nice so let's go ahead and grab let's see 
Let's put that one back. That's not an AB. Oh, let's go ahead and do the secret word. Um, so the secret word for this one, let's look at this image. See if I can get that. And it's going to be rain. Since we see some rain here, it's called rainy dreams. So remember to um, write that down so when the Google Doc is available. Okay, so let's get our ABs. We have one there and this pretty blue. Isn't this so pretty? So here's the fox just sleeping and here's a tree right here. And we have some leaves here. And then these are the rain. This is the rain. I think it's so cute. I was really excited to see this one. So if you love foxes, this is really cute. So how this works, if you buy this from Belle Arde Nicole, you can put your, your little bags here. And it just makes it easy. I've used it once with a diamond painting that had um, baggies and I really liked it. So, okay, so let's look for these. Right here we have this pretty, pretty, like, is that like kind of like a mint, light mint anyway? And it's 46 and that symbol is that one right here. Can you see it? Let me actually get it from over here. That symbol right there. So that's what we're going to look for. And look at, I actually found it quite quickly today. So let me, let's see, focus here, work with me. Okay, so I found it right here. It's all in this raindrops, actually. So all the rain, it looks like it's going to be in ABs. AB stands for Aurora Borealis, and it gives it just that extra shimmer and shine, and it's just beautiful. Like it's coating on there. And then this beautiful color is, let's see, it's easier to just do this. Looks like there's a music note. Oops, sorry about that. Oh. It looks like the sticky glue on the bag got stuck. Okay, so let's find a music note. It's a pretty blue. It's kind of dark. So you would think it would be... Hmm. Let me bring this up so you can also see the drill field. See how clear that is? my phone here. Let me take my glasses off so I can see through here better. Make sure it's focusing for you guys. I don't know why I'm having so many issues with that. Okay. I haven't seen the music notes yet. I'm sure they're here somewhere. Here they are. Right here. So the music notes are going to be in this area. If you can see the whole canvas, it's down here. Let's see if it's anywhere else. Let's look right here. There we go. Nope, those are H's, not music notes. So we do have some down here in this water. I like how this is, um, let me get my glasses back on. It looks like this is kind of like a a pool of, of water. Yeah. I like how that looks. It's pretty. Yeah, so I love the size of this one. Oh my goodness. I don't know what is going on with that. Did I put that there? Does it help? Let's put that here. Focus. Yes, I don't know why I'm having so much trouble with my with it focusing, but that is what I, oh, let's go over one more thing. So these are hand charted. So there's not like a super lot of confetti usually. And so like right here and all right here, this is all like color blocking or line blocking. And that just means that there's not a whole lot of different um, symbols, different colors where you'll be changing out your diamonds a lot. And confetti is when there's a lot of different symbols in one spot. Um, let's see if we could find any here where you'll be changing your drills out, but I don't really see a whole lot of confetti. 
So you know, right here, there's some line blocking. Yeah, I don't really see a whole lot of confetti. More like light confetti. Like right here, you'll be changing some out right here on the fox. So, yeah, so that is what I have for you today. Remember the uh, key word or special word for the giveaway that Bella Art Diamonds is giving away is rain. Okay, so thank you so much for watching. If you're here to, all the way to the end, I really appreciate it. And maybe we could put like a little fox tree or rain cloud, you know, just have fun with some of the emojis that remind you of this painting. So thank you so much for watching. I will see you in my next video. Bye.